I think affirmative action as a policy is needed and is necessary because it's a redress and it is a remedy for past wrongs that happened um, 50, 100, 300 years ago, um, not only for African Americans, but for people of color and um, women alike. So um, as I said, it's a redress to redo past wrongs that were done. Um, in America's early history. Race-based policies have had a positive impact on most um, campuses in my eyes by um, adding diversity to a school that wouldn't be there if it wasn't for these race-based policies. Um, I believe that these schools, if they weren't um, commanded to get these policies, they wouldn't allow these um, students in and the schools would just be of um, one ethnicity and of one background and just so people could have a better learning experience and a better way of looking at things. Um, if the U.S. Supreme Court upholds the basic underlying principle of affirmative action, I feel it is something that we can work with and something that we can develop and just continue to fight to get it to where we need it to go. My name is Gloria Raina Bowens II. I am of African American and Colombian descent, and I attend school at the University of Florida in Gainesville, Florida. Now, tell us your story.